And welcome for part two of Base Camping Operation Battle Axe on Let's Play Battlefield 1942. And I've finally been killed, and let's see if we can do even more base camping, I guess. Just put them out of their misery by now. They don't expect to win this map or anything. They're just kind of waiting for the tickets to go out. Alright, a tank spawned in. The reason I was bunny hopping toward that tank is it just seems like so often when you're running for a tank anywhere near enemy territory, that just as a like a magnet, as soon as you go for a tank, people start opening fire on you. Alright, now that uh, they've destroyed that last tank that was on their airstrip, it's time for me to take my turn. I'm just operating in shifts now. Those are actually friendly landmines on the airstrip. Okay, only one person spawned in there. Yeah, now they've got one flag, so there's going to be a lot of people who are going to be spawning in over there. Still, there's going to be a bunch of people up here who had spawned in previously and haven't either been killed yet or escaped. It's really amazing just how many people spawn in as anti-tank, and yet they don't get a shot off. Right, there's a... that's the hostile heavy tank. In fact, we haven't seen too much of that hostile heavy tank uh, previously in this round. It, it continually respawned at the upper portion of their base, so... I don't know why they didn't move it down. Alright, now I think I'm going to be pretty well clear to repair the tank, hopefully. That's why I put some extra bullets into it earlier. It's nice to just kind of weaken it. Not enough to make it smoking, but uh, just enough to make it easier to destroy when someone tries to jump into it. And it looks like uh, Germans had been hanging out at their flak guns. Normally when I'm base camping or... Man, it falls. Normally when I'm harassing an enemy base with a tank, you see me uh, moving around my tank a lot more, but uh, I was in a pretty good stationary position earlier on on the airstrip, and now the flak gun that they're using is being used very effectively. Yeah, I'm just, just kind of curious to see how long I could keep that alive. Alright, and that would be pretty much everybody, but I'm just going to slide down here. Yeah, I'm definitely going to need to take the tent, the plane that's in front so I don't crash into the empty one. And I've booby-trapped the other plane, so if they try to come after me, then hopefully they'll detonate the landmine. As you can see, this is kind of a, a small map. That's why you don't see... Um, That's why you do often see uh, planes really harassing the tanks a lot. I mean, uh, there's not a whole lot of ground to cover. You just kind of, in a few seconds, you can scan the whole place, find out where all the enemy tanks are. And I got a landmine kill, so I guess they tried to take out the plane. All right, I'm going to see if I can get at least one more plane kill here. 
safely down their tickets. And that'll do it for Let's Play Battlefield 1942. See you on the next episode.